welcome back to our channel so today we're doing a morning routine because i'm in my exam week at the moment i'm doing my a levels i've got a few more before half term and then a couple of exams at the end but i thought we would do a morning routine so i hope you enjoy this video smash a like if you do and subscribe to our channel if you're new and without further ado let's get into it madison what are a levels a levels are exams that you take when you're 17 and 18 they help get you into university is that what you're going to do hopefully if i pass them all where's mummy she's normally up by now i heard her this morning being sick do you think she's okay yeah you're right actually she's normally up before us i tell you what i'll go upstairs and check oh my goodness i'm in so much pain oh my goodness it's okay, Alice. Oh, it's okay. Mama, mama. Oh my goodness, Jess, are you okay? Oh, Madison, Madison, I can't move. I'm in so much pain. Can you get your sister out of the cot, please? Yeah, sure. Alice, come here, baby. Shh, 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 shh. It's okay, Alice. Mama, I know, baby, I know. Jess, are you okay? Oh, Madison, I'm in agony with my stomach. I'm getting these shooting pains. What is it? Do you think it's your periods? No, I'm not due for them. And I've been being sick all night. Yeah, Amy said she heard you. But what did Dad say? He's a doctor. He said that it could be a virus, but since he left to do his shift last night, it's been getting worse. Why didn't you wake me, Jess? Because you've got exams, Madison. I didn't want to stress you out but i can't move the pain is so bad are you being sick yeah amy told me that she heard you being sick in the night oh is amy okay yeah she's downstairs could you get us some breakfast or something sure but i'm all worried about you right now i think you might need to go to hospital jess i think you might be right okay right i'll go downstairs get amy some breakfast and i think i'm going to find you an ambulance because i'm kind of scared and i'm going to text dad okay madison i don't want a big fuss but you're sick you need oh, help guys the pain is so bad it's been getting worse all night it feels like i'm in labor all over again hello is that emergency yes i need an ambulance please it's my stepmom she's in absolute agony she's been vomiting all night i think she's got bad headache and cramps and i'm really worried about her uh, yeah, my name is Madison and the address is 105 Malibu Lane. Yes, that's right. Please, can you come quick? I'm really worried about her. Maddie, Maddie, it's okay. Just focus on the girls. Jess, I'm concerned. This isn't normal. Um, yeah, I'm not sure what's going on, to be honest with you. No, she said that she's already had her period. Please be quick. I'm really worried. Thank you so much. Jess, there's an ambulance on its way, but they said it might be a while because there's a lot of people waiting for ambulances at the moment. It's okay, Madison, I can wait. No, you can't. You look really bad. You're white as a sheet and you're sweating. I'll be okay. Just make sure Amy's okay for me and that she's not panicking, please. Okay, I will. What about your exam? This is more important. My exam's not till this afternoon anyway. So hopefully you'll be at hospital by then. I'll take Alice down. Come on, little one. And I'm going to text Dad as well. I know he might be in theatre or something, but I think he needs to know. <sighs> okay, Maddie, and thanks. Madison, what's going on? Mum's upstairs. She's in pain. So I've had to call an ambulance because we're not sure what it is. Is it bad? I don't know, but they're coming as quick as they can. In the meantime, Mum wants me to get you and Alice fed and ready for school. I'm going to have to call your dad to come and take you in. Okay, I want to know that Mummy's okay. Me too, but what do you want for your breakfast? I'm not really hungry, but you've got to eat something, Ma Amy. Okay, I'll just have cereal and I'll phone Ryan. Hi Ryan, it's Madison. Hi Madison, how come you're phoning me? I don't have anything to say to you. I've just had to phone an ambulance for Jess. She's got these really bad pains in her stomach and we don't know 
what's causing it or anything and dad's at work and obviously i haven't got a car so i'm phoning it to ask if you could come and pick amy up and take her to school oh my goodness is just okay is it serious i don't know but i need some help please can you come of course and instead of you waiting around for an ambulance for hours how about i come and pick jess up take her to the hospital and you take amy to school it'll be a lot quicker because ambulances can take ages yes if you're sure ryan that would be amazing thank you so much i'll let her know madison what's going on well i've just spoken to your dad and he's going to come and take mummy down to the hospital because apparently it'll be quicker than the ambulance and i'm going to drop you off at school i'll have to take alice with me and come back but what about mummy she'll be okay she just needs to be looked at by a doctor but luke's a doctor and he didn't notice mummy was ill I think things have got worse since my dad left for his shift last night. Come on, eat your breakfast then, because your daddy will be here soon to take your mum to hospital. <sighs> Jess, are you okay? No, <laughs> the pain. It's okay. Listen, I spoke to Ryan, and he's going to come and drive you to hospital. Oh, really? How come? Because he said it will be quicker than waiting for an ambulance. And I'll take Amy to school with Alice and come back. Oh, are you sure that would be amazing that's so kind of him he's really worried about you we all are now do you think you'll be able to get downstairs to ryan's car i'll try come on i'll give you a hand oh i don't think i can make it it's okay it's okay madison i'm here amy daddy mommy's in pain upstairs and it hurts and she's being sick and i'm really scared i'm worried about her it's okay baby i'm here to help and save the day thank you come here it's okay little one. Oh, ryan thank you so much for coming to help out it's okay madison it's clear this is an emergency and i'm here to save the day now where is jess she's upstairs laying on the bed she can't move she's in so much pain with her stomach i'm so worried about her it's okay you look after the girls and i'll get her to hospital okay don't worry and Amelia's already been dropped off at school, so it's not a problem. You're not inconveniencing me. I'll go up and bring her down. Thank you so much, Ryan, honestly. Come on, Amy, let's go upstairs and finish getting ready for school. But I want to stay at home and make sure Mummy's okay. Look, you're not going to know anything for hours. Hospitals can take so long. And the best place for you is to be at school. It'll help distract you, okay? Okay, Daddy. And anyway, Amelia will be there, won't she? Yeah. And anyway, Madison, where's Luke? He's at work. He was on a night shift. How come he went in if he knew Jess wasn't feeling well? She told him to, and he wasn't. she wasn't feeling that bad yesterday. She th just thought it was a virus, I think. But things have got worse in the night. Mm, right, OK. Right, Alice, let's get you in the stroller, and I'm going to find the ambulance people and cancel it, because we don't want to waste their time. Hey, I have arrived to save the day. Jess? Oh, Ryan, I'm so pleased to see you. Thank you for helping. It's okay. Stay calm. Look, I'm going to get you to hospital, okay? Where are the girls? They're fine. They're downstairs. Amy is going to go to school with, with Madison. We'll get everything sorted. We just need to get you up and get you in the car. Come on. Oh, my stomach's in agony. It feels like childbirth. It's okay. I'm right here and I'm going to get you to hospital. Now, you're going to have to let me pick you up, okay? Okay, Ryan. Right, let's get you down to the car. Oh, it really hurts. It's okay, I've got you. I won't drop you. Now, come on, let's go. And I'll get Madison to pack your bag. Oh, what do you think it is? I don't know, Jess. I'm not a doctor, but let's get you down to A&E and let the professionals look at you. Has Madison text Luke? Yes, she did, but he hasn't replied, so it's down to me to help. Now, come on, let's get to the car. All right, so we're now all ready to go. I'll pack a little bag for Jess when I get back from dropping you off. I really want to stay at home. You can't, sweetheart, because your dad told me that you've got to go to school, so that's what has to happen. But what about you? You're not going. I have to. I've got an exam later. And anyway, my dad will be able to go and see with Jess, won't he? But in the meantime, we just have to do as your dad says, OK? OK, Madison. Come on then, let's get going.